we live in a day and age where, where you can get a real sense that Christianity is being pushed to the margins. And if you're paying attention to your social media feeds or you're watching the news or you're, um, man, just reading the things that are out there to read, you're gonna hear a lot about how the church is shrinking, how young people are leaving the church, um, that, that we're um, bigoted, that we're, um, we, we hate people. That you, you get this, this picture that no longer are we in the center, no, no longer is it cool to be a Christian, but rather um, it can cost you to be. One of the things that we can just embrace as we see the church heading towards the margins, although I'm not looking forward to persecution or being misunderstood or misrepresented, the Church of Jesus Christ historically has thrived in the margins. And so I, as you're seeing what looks to be the storm gathering in the distance, and some of you are in the middle of that storm already, I just wanna encourage you to take heart because our God has overcome the world. Take heart because the church has been here before and she has thrived in this space. I want you to take heart because the sovereign king of glory rules and reigns over all the days and you and I have literally been put where we've been placed with the gifts and talents God has given us for the glory of Jesus Christ and the good of the gospel in our world. Take heart, our king has overcome the world.